Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to um, build a rustic blacksmith. So the blocks that you're going to need are some of these, also some of these, and a couple other ones, but they're not in my quick slot. So you want to start with a spruce log. I'm going to start right here. Um, like, well, you're not going to probably be building like an area, but I'm just going to start right here. It's a pretty big build. And you want to go four blocks up. And you want to go over by five. And then do that again. And then for the um, other side, you want to go over by, well, you just want to count in. And go over by one, two, three, four, five six, seven, and then place one right here. That makes sense. I, I don't think that does, but basically there's seven blocks across and build some by four. And basically do that on the other side so you can kind of just match it up. There, okay, just making sure. And then um, for, the, uh, for the first part, of the build, you want to take either your andesite and cobblestone. Well, first, I'm just going to start out on the inner side. That will make it um, like inset, so it has a more of a frame. And you just kind of want to make a ring of cobblestone going around, and then take your andesite and kind of mix it into your cobblestone, kind of randomly. Just throw it in. This one right here, and that just basically um, makes it look like a little age and more detail. The same thing that we did on the windmill over there. And then you want to take, um, well, I don't have those, I gotta get those. Take some cobblestone stairs and just place them, three of them in the front, right in the center. And then you want to get, oh, I gotta go back. You have to get your spruce planks and make a ring around the outside. Like this, and you're finished. And then you need to take that up by three. Don't worry about any door or window, we'll put those in later. Just kind of fill all this in. Okay, so now since you're done with that, um, I need to like break holes for your like 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 a window and door. So you want to break one right in the center for your um, door. Then you want to go to the um, outside. And you want to on the left. You want to go right in the middle. Go two blocks in, and then break three. So it's right in the center. On the other one, you always want to break one. And second and there's none on this side because we're going to get to this side later and let me go get some oh, those weren't inside of my things I have enough space fill that in and fill the, the um, these holes with the one block and the three block with the glass then we need to is that in my no I don't think it is okay Kind of looking around for door. Is this first one? Okay. And then you want to go on the inside and place it. And that will basically place it in the like inner part of the um, like wall and gives it a little bit extra depth. And we won't be doing the interior, but to if you want to just fill all this in with spruce. So that's just like just fill all this in. But we're not gonna put anything inside. And then to, we're gonna start getting, we're gonna start doing the other um, part, which you need to go five blocks um, from right here. So, you, oh, I guess I'll use cobblestone, and they'll like put the andesite in later. I think that's how you're supposed to do it. Let me check. Yeah, five blocks from this post right here. 
Is that five? That is six. Okay. And then do that all the way up, like on the other side. Oh, too far. To where I think it meets on the back. No, it does not. Right here. Okay, so that's where that goes. Then you want to fill in the rest of this. Second. Check. Yeah, you want to fill in all this. And you want to go up by three. Okay, so now since you're done with that, you now you need to break some like gaps. And you need to break one, two. Oh, not, not right there. Okay, you need to get rid of that. And you need to go in to here, like that. And then you need to put um, a couple of cobblestone stairs if I have those. Nope, that's the wrong thing right there. Okay. Put cobblestone stairs from three blocks from the post right here the spruce post and then you need to put, oh I don't have those go look around smooth stone okay you need some smooth stone slabs and you need to place those around the top of um, this cobblestone part and then for the and then for the inside you need to go in but you need to go one more. Oh, I don't have that. Wait, I take that out, and then go to two, and make go in two, one more, and then kind of make a ring around the outside, and make sure you leave this into hollow. And this is where you need to place polished your polished andesite. Oh, that's a spruce log, and that kind of just gives it a little bit more of like a tile-like look. And then now, um, in all the cobblestone parts, just kind of mix in a little bit of andesite. Okay, so now since you're done with that, um, you need to, um, well I guess we can do this side now. The, uh, the actual like house bits part of it. And you need to get some dark oak slabs and you need to place it on the top half of the block. Make sure you do that. And you kind of need to do that on all sides. So go around this side and this side. And I think you, yeah, you, you do put one. Also, this right here, make sure you fill that all the way in. Sorry about that. And then you're finished with that part. And then to for like the part of the roof, you need to get your dark oak stairs and place them across this side and this side. Oh. So both sides. Oh, okay. And then we need to we need spruce wood. And we need to place that on the spruce part right up here in kind of a pyramid shape like that. Five along and then three up. And then place your stairs um, up here. Okay, oh, <laughs> I fell off. Um, do that on both sides. Okay, so now since you finished that part, um, you now need to probably fill in this side and then do that. Do the same type of pyramid shape. Oh, nope, I did it wrong. Do that one in. Messed up. Place one up there. And just do that on the next layer.
Okay, so now since you finished that, you need to go on the inside and place one a stair underneath. Oh, oh that was underneath. Uh, underneath the stairs you just placed. Down both sides. And this kind of just makes it look a little like smooth and makes it look a little bit more like there's more, more, there's more wood. And then place one stair upside down to where on like the block that there's a stair upside down. Do it on both sides. And then place a stair like the um, a normal like right side up on top. And then for the middle part, you just need to place a couple slabs. Wait just a second. Oh no, I messed up. Place a stair um, like facing against it. And then place your slabs across the top. Oh, and I also did mess up. Also, I did, well, I didn't really tell you about this. Fill in all of your oak, um, no, not all your oak, all your dark oak with spruce. Okay, so now since you're done with that, um, you need to place in your windows, which I need to get my stained glass, or not my stained glass, just my glass panes, and place one from the block right next to the um, like the dark oak beam. Go two up like that, and do that on both sides. Do it on this side too, and then um, you need to go inside here. This is going to be some more extra detail. Oh, no, wrong thing. Okay. Okay. So now, since you have this, just a second. Now we're gonna do the, like the part of like the blacksmith, the actual blacksmith, blacksmith part. And for like the main furnace, go exactly, not exactly center. Um, go from these two blocks right here, and place two um, blast furnace then get your oh do I have oh no I don't have okay I s your smooth stone slabs and place those underneath doubled up like that then take some iron bars and place them kind of in this shape right here so two on both sides and two in front and then for the top bit up here you need to Place a stair on the left furnace, or blast furnace, and then grab your slabs. You can double these up or use an all block. And then place your um, cobblestone wall on top. Okay, and then you need a stair, no, not a stair, a chest, sorry, and a crafting table right there. So one right in that corner, one right next to this like piece that juts out and then we just need a couple extra things I need a oh, all the way down here we need a smithing table and a grindstone so for the um, grindstone just place it right here on this edge and the smithing table goes right here and then for the um, we also need a Let's go grab one. Oh, I don't know what I did. Okay, there. Um, get a dark oak stair and place it facing like towards the um, grindstone as like a chair. And then this part is done. And we just need to do an extra couple extra details. Oh, wrong thing. There. We also need to get some barrels over here. And we're just going to place a couple of these around, like the build. We need like a little stack right here. So I place one right there, one right here, one right there, and then one right here. And on this one, I'll just place one right here. And there is your finished blacksmith. 
So I hope you liked this. I, I hope you um, found this video useful. I'll see you next time. Bye.